escape with the virus. <laughs> if I move now, he'll see me. Those shotguns pack a punch. Better stay out of his line of sight. Wallard's desperate. <sighs> no way to sneak past this one. I'll need to distract him. My bat stunner would set off the car alarm. And that should get the guard moving. Right now. We ain't giving him up. He cares about Gotham. You're all gonna pay. What you and your agency are doing here isn't right. Ah! Tell me where John Doe is. <sighs> I ain't no rat. That's too bad. Rats have a knack for survival. Kill him. Ah! Batman. These agents are crazy, Batman! They're gonna kill us! This stops now, agent. Waller said you'd be trouble. That you'd protect John Doe. But I'm thinking, that can't be right. Doe's a monster. And these clowns here? They call him a hero. That's not what you think, right? John is my friend. Yes, he's made mistakes. Grave ones. But he doesn't deserve to be hunted down by the likes of you. That's disappointing. 
You help them, you're helping him. And if you're helping John Doe, you're the enemy too. Fire! Hit him again! What the hell? I'm late! Almost missed my own debut! <laughs> John? Nope! Better than John! Come on, partner! Time for some justice! <laughs> Authorized. Well, this is unlucky for these guys. Team, don't you think? We do make a pretty good team. Right! We're gonna do such great things! I know it! John? Yeah. Joker! What? There is no more John Doe. <laughs> it's Joker now. It's my hero name. Like you know, Batman. I tried out a few other ones. Birdman, Hawkman, Fox Batman, The Giggler, Chuckle Master, Lord of the Laughs, and The Joke Man. You know, I like it. Oh, I thought you would. It's a name people are going to remember. We've done good work today, Batman. Waller still doesn't have the virus. We kept the agency from killing my friends. Tried two out of four new moves. Wait a second. Wasn't that Harrison guy, like, right over there? Drop it! Drop the asset! <laughs> Pain. You're working with them? Director Waller promised you revenge. Here's your chance. Get out of here! We're not leaving you. Me and Batman, we've got this. Remember. The director wants Batman alive. I don't care what she wants. Do as you're told. Pathetic. Oh, <laughs> 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 
some improvements to the market. the monologue. Finish the job! You pitiful little man! Call that monster off! Let go! <laughs> Use the car. Drive it into Bane when I give you the signal. Don't die before I'm ready. Now, we can do this my way! Joker, no! Hey, Bane! You've got a little something on your shirt! You will pay for killing my friend. What are you? Riddler! Waller told me what you did. You let Batman defeat him, and then you struck like a coward. No, I didn't, Batman. I, I, I didn't. You would work with such a man? A murdering coward? I said I didn't kill him. Waller's a liar. I didn't kill Riddler. <laughs> What? <laughs> what was that? You... I can't... I, I can't believe you! You shouldn't have stopped me! Don't you remember who this is? Look how many innocent people he's killed! He almost killed you! Again! He just needed one more good stab to an artery, and it would be over! You can't be a killer and a hero. It's one or the other. Says who? Not history! Do you think that... Okay. Okay. Heroes like us don't kill. Even when they're wrongfully accused of murder. Why does Waller think you killed Riddler? Uh, I, I don't know. I... She probably did it. She's probably trying to pin it on me. But I didn't. You know that, right? <clears throat> Batman! You, you hurt! Stay where you are! You are both under arrest! We gotta get out of here! Bruce, are you all right? I need a quick patch up. And I'm not alone. I'll come to you. Sending coordinates. You must be John. 
He goes by Joker now. You know who I am? Bruce has mentioned you, yes. Really? What'd you tell him about me? All good things, I hope. Alfred knows you're a friend of mine. And any friend of Batman's? Bruce! I know. We're tight like that. Uh, yes, he informed me. That's great! No secrets between us. We're all part of the club. Wow! The Alfred! I've been collecting tabloid photos of Bruce for years, and you're in the background of at least a third of them. You're hurt. Let me have a look. Let's get this off you. I'll take care of stapling the wound. Can you... I'll prepare the compress. Can I help, Alf? You mind if I call you that? Please don't. And thank you, this is a one-person job. Oh, okay. I could just listen to you speak all day with that accent. It's like a Dickens novel come to life. I bet it comes in very handy around Christmas. Maybe... Maybe I was British before I come. Does this sound natural? Oi, you there, boy. Get the Queen her beans for breakfast. How's that sit with you? Not well. Your honesty is appreciated. So, I'm dying to know, what was Bruce like as a little tyke? An angel, perfect in every way. Really? Yes, if you discount all the terrible, terrible things he did. <laughs> I knew it! I bet it was quite the production getting this one to go to bed. Even when he was little, he was probably like, No, Alfred. I am the knight. <laughs> Hey, Alfred, where does one go to learn butlering? Is there school? Is that what the B in MBA stands for? It isn't. My father served the Wayne family. And well, when my service in the military concluded, I was looking for something with a similar structure and discipline. Something more familiar than a normal civilian life. I, I hear you. I felt that way when I left Arkham. I took over my father's role, and now we find ourselves here today. Wow! The military, huh? G.I. Alfred. G.I. is for you Yanks. B.I. British Infantry. No. Did Bruce mention Waller took a shot at me? Uh, he did. Yeah. You gotta be a person of pretty high import to get on her radar. Public enemy numero uno over here. She wants you dead, jo Joker. <laughs> yeah. Well, feelings mutual. How many rooms does Wayne Manor have? Are there wings? Yes, I divide it into wings for ease of management. And I suppose the room count is based on your definition of room. Four walls? Well, do you consider the larder a proper room? Or the tack room, the conservatory, the scullery, the rotunda? I, I don't know what any of those words mean. <laughs> Holy crap, Bruce. You are so rich. How old is the mansion? Is it considered a historical place? Ooh, is it haunted? You ever hear any bumps in the night? 
No, it's quite poltergeist-free. Well, I, I would have thought, uh, you know, uh, maybe Bruce's parents knock around, just checking up on him. Well, uh, uh, uh. well I know if I died, I'd certainly haunt this guy. <laughs> So, Joker. What's up? That looks a lot like a batarang. A batarang? <laughs> no, I don't even see how you'd think it. Uh oh. Y yeah, maybe. But but it isn't. It's totally unique. It's a Joker ring. Uh huh. They're really warm been in my pocket all day. I said I'd throw it a hundred times a day, and I did. I'm a real dead-eye now. Well, good work. Well, I certainly thought so. You've got a new look. Awesome, right? You'd be amazed what you can find in thrift stores, but also on mannequins in fancy stores when no one's looking. Certainly makes an impression. Well, I was aiming for a... Batman. But me! Dark and scary. Like my best bud. But also flashy and fun. <laughs> it finally feels like the right skin. Uh-huh. When you jumped off the bridge, that was one hell of a drop. What happened after? That was crazy, right? <laughs> it seemed like a fast getaway. Terminal velocity and all. Anyway, I hit. Sploosh! And it was dark and cold and wet for a while. Then I ended up grabbing onto some flotsam. Or, or was it jensum? No, 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 it was flotsam. Floated on that until I hit the shore, found Frank from the stack deck, and got some dry clothes. Gave me a different outlook, you know? New lease on life. <laughs> Glad it worked out. I should get back to my arm. Of course. <laughs> I don't want you getting gangry. That's gonna have to come out. Well, this ought to be fun. <laughs> Guessing there's no way this doesn't sting. These should do the job. Oh, come on. Okay, done. We've had too much practice as of late. Guess it's just one of those Wayne luxuries, huh? Having someone like Alfred to take care of you. You're kind of his ward, huh? Do people still use that word? Alfred's always been there for me. After my parents died, he became the person I could count on the most. Everything in the line of duty? Sure, Al. Oh, you guys are so cute. Alfred, I kind of got hurt in that scuffle, too. Do you think... Um... Oh. Come on, it's hardly a... Please. Mm. God damn it, that stings! <sighs> in, in a really heartfelt, caring kind of way. It's Waller. Batman. We know what you did, Waller. You're gonna regret. Sorry, sorry. So you're with our mutual friend. Good. It'll make this convenient. I want John Doe. Joker! I'm sorry. John Doe and the virus. 
in two hours, or I go public with your identity. I don't want to burn you down, Bruce, but I will. Let's talk about this. Actions speak louder than words, Bruce. The virus, your joker, at the GCPD, two hours. To kill me! Kill me or turn me into a slave like Bane! And look what happened to him! I don't want to have some maniac stab Waller me! Waller won't stop coming after you until she gets the virus. But we can't give it to her. We have to destroy it. We do? Why? Not that I'm second-guessing you. I just want a reason. You wanted to be a hero. This is how we do it. This is how we keep people safe. With the virus gone, Waller won't see you as much of a threat. Well, I don't like the sound of that. She's going around telling lies, pinning murders on me. She has to pay for what she's done. I could put just the slightest hint of virus in Waller's shampoo, or maybe her perfume. Technically, I'd still be giving her the virus. I only want to see her melt. A little liquefy her insides. A tiny bit. I thought I made it clear. Heroes don't resort to murder to solve their problems. No, but it's so effective. I don't know. Dr. Leland did say I had trouble letting things go. No issue. So what am I supposed to do? Give up my grudges? What am I gonna lie awake at night stewing over then? It just makes me so angry. You have to rein in your darker impulses. That pain will only rot you from the inside out. Uh. Well, if you say it's the right thing to do. I'm trusting you on this. Now, right here. That's it. That's it. Completely inert now. Joker, Bruce and I need a moment. Oh, okay. I'll, uh, check the perimeter. I'm relieved to see he listens to you. You can balance him out. Just don't take your eyes off him. Coast is clear. Waller has leverage on me. We need a countermeasure. Perhaps someone on the inside can help. Someone who's lost faith in Waller's crusade. You have someone on the inside? Agent Blake. Sacrificed himself to protect Agent Avesta. I don't think he's the best option. I mean, on account of him being dead. Agent Harrison. Deceased, courtesy of Bane. Jim Gordon, formerly commissioner. Jim has no love for Waller, but without being on the inside, it's a long shot he'd be able to help. Harleen Quinzel, currently in the agency's custody after the incident on the bridge. God, they better be treating her right. She's not the best with rules, or authority, or cafeteria dining. <sighs> Selena Kyle. M.I.A. since escaping the murder box in the subway. Agent Amon Avesta. She changed her tune about Waller after the raid on the Sanctus facility. If she's looking for a way to fight back, you could give it to her. She's our best bet. Batman. Waller's threatened to reveal my identity if I don't hand over Joker and the virus. 
I need some information on her. Something to negotiate with. Well, you came to the right person. When do you need it? I'm meeting her at the GCPD in two hours. Meet me on the roof in one. I'll have a little present for you. We're taking the Batmobile? We're taking the Batmobile? Joker and Batman, heroes of Gotham. <laughs> We're not here for a fight. You need to make yourself scarce. Waller is only a few floors below us. All right, I'll do the dignified thing and hide. So if things go south, I can surprise them from the shadows. <laughs> No, I... I know. I, I just need a place to stay for a little while. It's just... I had car paid up when I'm mom on. Mom on, mom on. Look, don't worry about it. It's only a job. You just need to get paid up when I'm home. Yeah, it's... It's hard. I'm gonna try and find somewhere in Gotham Valley man name do now. Hop. Are. Are. Right. Yeah. Me do now. I I'm sorry. I have to go. I'll call you later, okay? Batman. I'm glad you came. <sighs> Waller's really gonna do it. If you don't give her Joker, she'll shout your identity from the rooftops. I know you said that things were okay between us, but I can't shake the feeling I'm to blame. After the fallout with Harley at the bridge, now this... I'm sorry I told Waller your secret. Let me make it up to you. I found something on Waller. Something big. I threw together a document. Details just how dirty her hands are. Sanctus, the experiments, Riddler. It's a little unbelievable, but it's worse than I thought. When the agency initially dissolved Sanctus, Waller was responsible for cleanup. In public record, she did exactly that. But that isn't what happened. No. She saved samples and data. She just couldn't let it go. Not when it had so much potential. And someone from Sanctus got their hands on it. She's to blame for all of this. If she had just done her job and destroyed the virus, none of this would have happened. Nice work, Amon. I've seen enough. With this in your pocket, Waller loses her leverage over you. Thank you, Amon. I guess it's all over now. It's only a matter of time before Waller realizes what I've done. She'll want to keep this buried, so it's unlikely she'll take this to internal affairs. But that won't stop her from ending my career. Or from making my life a nightmare. God. I remember begging Waller for the Gotham assignment. <laughs> it's funny how quickly things change. Come work with me. We'd be lucky to have you. At Wayne Enterprises? Or should I get fitted for body armor? I'd go with Wayne Enterprises. 
Better benefits. I might take you up on that. Thank you. Well, it's just you and Waller now. Hopefully the next time I see you, it will be to talk about my salary. Well, well, well. Sorry to interrupt. Not only are you aiding and abetting a wanted criminal, you corrupted one of my most loyal agents. Someone I trusted. Someone I took under my wing. And you did this for what? To throw away such a promising career. She works with me now, right, Avesta? So you won't even try to deny it. You've crossed a line, Batman. You helped that maniac escape with the virus. The virus is destroyed. I saw to it myself. Destroyed? Fine. Well, I don't see John Doe wrapped up in a bow. Are you here to take his place? Because that's not what I asked for. I'm pretty sure I was clear on that. I'm here to make a deal. A deal? With you? You'll want to hear what he has to say. I'm done listening. They all work for me now. A special task force for special problems. Oh my god. Even your old friend Catwoman. Hey, Bats. You're outmatched. Time to stop this foolishness and get back into line. With the rest of the team. You intolerable. I don't want to work with that gloomy ink blot. Way too many issues. They don't intimidate me, and neither do you. Then let's go, Bats. Let's see what you got. Oh, you're confident, Batman. But then you'd have to be with the crap you've pulled. This is wrong, Waller. You can't use criminals to do your dirty work. Why should good people die fighting the likes of them? Or the likes of you and John Doe? You put my people in the hospital, protecting a maniac who killed at least three of my agents. A maniac who stabbed me in the gut. You're on the wrong side of this. You have to see that. Just trying to keep people alive. That's my job. Yours too. Though you wouldn't know it from the things you've done. What do you mean? What did she tell you? There's nothing on me I can't handle. Whatever you think you've got will bounce off me like rain off an armored truck. You know why they call me the Wall, Batman? Because you can't break through me. I stand tall no matter what you throw my way. You think I haven't dealt with more impressive threats than you? You're a pawn, Batman. I'm the goddamn queen. You know if your superiors see this, it destroys your career. <laughs> what do you want? I want you and the agency out of Gotham today. Okay. With the virus gone, my work here is done. I'll order my people to pack That's up- That's not all. Don't push it, Batman. I still know your identity. This is a stalemate, not a rout. No action against Agent Avesta. Legal or otherwise. She compromised our mission. That can't go unpunished. I'll tell you what. I'll give Avesta immunity from prosecution. You'll have my word I won't come after her personally. On one condition. Hand over Doe. You know he'll be better off locked away. Better for himself and for everyone else. Otherwise, we're even. Me and my people are out of this godforsaken town. I won't look back. I won't betray him. Not even for that. Then our business is concluded. For now. No! No, 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 no! Ah! 
That's not acceptable! Not at all! What the hell? It's John Doe. Oh, put in! Come out, come out, wherever you are! You've got the biggest villain in Gotham right in front of you! And you're just letting her waltz on out of town? That is so very disappointing! You're a hypocrite! You're letting her off the hook because of what? Because she has a badge? Given what she knows, it's the best I can do. You're letting her off the hook! You think you're some kind of force for justice, Joker? Don't you see how ridiculous that is? What's ridiculous is that anyone believes your lies! You blame me for your crimes when we both know you killed Riddler! Are you serious? Think whatever you want. You will never be a hero. How dare you? You're worse than me. That makes me the hero. And this is what heroes do to villains. What are you doing? Doing what you apparently can't. Shining a light on the shadiest part of Gotham. <laughs> Kill him! With pleasure! Yeah! Not yet! Agency gave me a little upgrade. What do you think? Rat, you. I'm going to give you the sentence you deserve. Joker, stop. You and your. Stupid toad! Batman! The caller! Woman, detain Batman. The rest of you, take care of Doe. <gasps> Consider this karma. Me to die in that box. How could you? I guess I should have known I was expendable. There were lives at stake. Oh, yeah. You're a real hero. Back off, cat lady! That's enough! You're cornered, Batman! Give up, Joker! Now! Or I'll take you both down! Last chance! <laughs> <laughs>
going! Together, on my count. One, two, three. Good, again. Okay, last time. Get you to a hospital. Bat suit. See you. <laughs> Badmobile. It'll get me home. Okay, I'll get help. Please just hang in there. Batman. Batman! Uh, a guy walks into a doctor's office. A guy says, uh, Doc, I've got this thing with my hands. It won't stop shaking and it's, it's driving me mad. And the, uh, the doctor says, have you been drinking a lot? And the guy says, <laughs> No, not, uh, not really. I spill most of it. <laughs> oh, heard that one before, have you? Pretty sure from you. Uh, it never was quite so relevant before. I decided my bedside manners could use some adjustment. Admonishing you never seems to get us anywhere. Try not to move until the painkillers settle in. That leg still needs to heal, as do the third, eighth, and tenth ribs. How did I get here? Agent Avesta. She managed to get you into the Batmobile. The car arrived here, and... and I tended to you. It must be nice to be reminded that you have friends you can count on. And then there are friends who do things like this. He could have killed you. He nearly did. Alfred, John is just... He has trouble controlling his impulses, and he... sometimes he acts without thinking. Okay, maybe more than sometimes. I know you care for him, Bruce, but he's hurt people. A lot of people. And I... Well, I'm sorry to say, but it's only gotten worse. Computer, bring up all live news feeds. Filter for the word Joker. Gotham is 
still picking up the pieces after a man calling himself Joker led an assault on the GCPD. There has been no confirmation whether Amanda Waller, director of the agency, is still alive. The pursuit led onto the sidewalk where frightened citizens dove for cover. Officers chased the madman for hours after the attack, we know but that lost him in the chaos. Eleven people were seriously this injured. This incident has many wondering: Who is the Joker? Where did he come from? And where will his reign of terror end? You advised him to try and rein in his urges. Reports have confirmed eight casualties. And you appear to be waiting for him to succeed in that, after everything he's done. You helped make him, you know. Excuse me? This Joker? From the start, John has hung on your every word. Bend over backwards to please you. Your influence is everywhere in him. Even the part of you that is darkest. And now he is that. I can't give up on him, Al. There's still a chance I can bring him back from the edge. You're not what, Al? Nothing. I'm sorry, I... Uh, I shouldn't have said all that to you, the, the shape you're in. I've had too much time to think while you've been recovering. <clears throat> Careful now. All the way up, Batman. It's time to meet your new partner. <laughs> sorry, my what? Uh, uh, that was your cue, dear. Uh, did you not... I'm not ready! Tiffany. Yes. Is my partner. Well, I was hesitant at first, but I just couldn't talk her out of it, Bruce. She has your drive, your passion. Just like when you became Batman. That's a difficult thing to say no to. After Lucius died, you mentioned that we should recruit. Well, now we have. At least hear her out. All right, I'm trusting you on this one. If you think something like this can work, then I'm willing to give it a shot. Oh, I'm not sure about this at all. But I wasn't sure about Batman either. I may have my doubts, but... You need the help right now, and I mean you to have it. have to put a stop to him, Bruce. I know you will, but whatever feelings you may have had for John, don't let him use them against you. You can't allow him to cloud your judgment. It's not that easy, Al. He was my friend. I can't just treat him like every other criminal. Then you'll need to be on your guard. While you were out, I've kept abreast of the authorities' search for Joker and his associates. John has often mentioned he misses Arkham. Maybe he's hiding there. I, I thought of that. I'm afraid our own drone network has come up empty in a search of the asylum grounds and its catacombs. The agency searched the subway lair the Pact had been using. They found nothing and raised what was left to the ground. Uh, as for the GCPD, they've investigated John's other favorite haunt, the Stacked Deck. Interviews there yielded nothing useful other than the fact John and a few of his regulars he's recruited to his cause haven't frequented the establishment in over a week or so. Willie Deaver on the left, and that's Frank Dumfrey. Waller set up a stake out at the funhouse after her agent's bodies were found. She has people there around the clock. 
John's gone to ground and in none of the usual places that we know about. I'm done. My word. Well, you certainly look the part. Just wait till you see what it can do. Oh my god. Bruce, are you okay? Don't worry. It looks worse than it is. Yes, you get used to him lying like this, unfortunately. Is this... Is this what happens to you all the time? Alfred's right, Tiffany. This happens all the time. Me getting hurt or almost killed. And this time he's telling the truth. It's a long shot, but the water tower, where Joker set his ambush for the agency, it's still an active crime scene. A little bit of luck, there may be something there I can use to track him. I'm coming with you. Chemical sniffers, advanced sensor suites, early warning defense nodes, all with sync capability directly to your cow. It scans and catalogs evidence in a nanosecond. Maybe even faster than the back computer. It's even got some defensive options. Non-lethal, of course. It sounds like a plan. I won't let you down. I won't let either of you down. Let's get to work. You'll need these. For the pain. You, uh, you're forgetting something. Nervous. Isn't everyone before their first crime scene? How do you... I mean... How do we do this? Watch what I do, and keep cool. Easier said than done. You'll get the hang of it. How do I sound? Oh, God! That's not how it's supposed to sound! That needs some work. You'll get it. Batman, I didn't expect to see you here. And this is? She's with me, Detective. We might not be able to give you a lot of time. With Waller kidnapped and me getting canned, no one's sure whose jurisdiction this crime scene falls under. The agencies or the GCPDs. So for now, let's go ahead and say it's yours, all right? My people are here to help however they can. Glad you're here, Jim. I'd heard that... Technically, I'm not here. Not in an official capacity, anyway. Working outside of the law. Let me know if you need any pointers. What should we be looking for? After the pack separated, Joker had to find somewhere else to hide. There could be clues here that tell us where that is. And where he may have taken Waller. So this partnership between you and Batman, when did that happen? It's new. Looks like it was crushed. 
Is that a boot print? It's tungsten steel, though. Hard to break that just by stepping on it. Bane's a big boy. Remarkable craftsmanship. And silver filigree. He's become quite the showman these days. John Doe doesn't seem particularly crafty. Well, maybe they had a shop class in Arkham. They don't. Drone. Bane's venom. His suit was punctured. It's everywhere. Is it useful? No. Not in finding Joker. I'll add it to ignore on the drone search filters. Joker's knife. Must have lost it after he went into a frenzy against Bane. John Doe thought he could take on Bane? He's not half bad in a fight, actually. Bane's blood won't lead us to Joker. Nothing of note. Electrical burns. From the agency guns? Hmm. They were firing wildly. It's a subpar design for a firearm. Too prone to misfire. Electrical discharge heats the barrel too quickly, causing erratic fire patterns. Ah, so you're also an expert on guns. I've designed a few myself, actually. Smoke pellet. Jokers. Potassium nitrate and cane sugar. Homemade. Sloppy. A custom tungsten steel joker rang, but smoke pellets you can make in your kitchen? Hmm. His gear. It's made by different people. Forensics ran it through the system. Found it was stolen from the stack deck a few weeks ago. I recognize it. It's been customized since then. My drone can analyze it. Just point and I'll shoot. Huh. This car is hotwired. It's a mess. Well, you think a guy like him would have stolen a car before? He's unconventional. That's one way to put it. Hmm. Someone was thirsty. What do you think? Wanna run DNA? No. We already know who it belongs to. Get some details on this paint. Funny. Doesn't look like a rush job. Because it's not. The drone sees a body shop quality strip below the top layer. The paint uses a stripping solvent that hasn't met compliance standards since. I'll run a check on manufacturers in the area, see who's recently been dinged for safety regulations. This much data, we're gonna need something to narrow it down. Like a name. Kids are natural at this. What happened here? Joker hit Bane with his car. Eesh. I'll be out of insurance. Custom plates. Probably didn't get this done at the DMV. Lil Puddin? Must be his way of remembering his time with Harley. I miss this, you know. You and me raking over a crime scene. Oh, I messed it up, didn't I? Now, in the early days when we were chasing you, not realizing you were one of the good guys. You and I came to an agreement. We worked together to make Gotham safer. I lost my head the other day. I want you to know I'm sorry. I cracked, like I said I would when Waller first moved in. 
I said and did some things I'm not proud of. And I regret it. You were just doing what you thought was right, Jim. There's nothing to apologize for. You're a good man for saying that. I've missed this too. Got something interesting. It's a faint signal. A controller to the shock collars that Waller's using on the pact. Damaged. Can you isolate the signal from this device? Sure, but why? I've seen what these collars can do. Might come in handy. Welcome, Agency Pigs. <laughs> Here I thought that was our nickname. Hmm. Not sure Riddler would like the new decor. This Joker guy going nuts. I heard it started with Riddler's murder, but he's blaming Waller for it. Wouldn't actually surprise me. Riddler's murder? Really? But maybe it was always just a matter of time before he snapped. Festive, but not a lead. A maker's mark. W.D. Willie Deaver, Joker's associate. What do you have on him? Machinist by trade, with a storied employment history. He's been fired from almost every factory and chemical plant in Gotham. Has a drinking problem, apparently. Chemical plants. Huh. Let me cross-reference Willie Deaver's former employers with the paint used on Joker's car. Ace Chemicals. Their main plant was shut down last year after the city cited them for multiple safety violations. Because of the paint. The plant's been abandoned ever since. Perfect hiding spot. We found him. Well, well, well. What's all this, then? A bat and a walking mustache trespassing on my crime scene. You escaped. <laughs> you got it all wrong, batty boy. I'm here on agency business. <sighs> For the love of God. That's right. I'm one of the good guys now. So hand over everything you found before I knock out those pearly whites. In the name of the law. Batman, we don't have time to mess around with this clown. Make time, copper. You all take orders from me now. You're going back to jail, Harley. I don't care what deal you made with Waller. Let me show you how things work around here now, Batsy. This is Agent Quinn. Suppressing fire. convinced I can save their director from Big Bad Joker. They'll do anything for me. So all you gotta do is tell me where John took her so I can get back to my job. After all, Johnny Boy and I are due for a nice long talk. Poor guy's falling in with the wrong crowd. You know him better than anyone. Let's work together on this. Oh, now there's an idea. You can tee him up, and I'll knock his head off his shoulders with my government-issued hammer. We're taking him alive. That's so. Your offer just got way less interesting. <laughs> and here I thought being diplomatic would work with you people. Oh well, I'll try something you can understand. I need to... Hey! You cops can't just shoot people like that! I'm off duty. Hello? What's the girl gotta do to get some firepower in here? Shoot them! The hell? Asset in the line of fire! Don't shoot! 
I could hack those collars in my sleep. Toya. Got it, sir. What the hell do you think you're doing? Sending you off to Blackgate, where you belong. <laughs> oh, please! The agency isn't gonna let me sit in a cell. I'm an asset. I'm gonna get what I want! And there's not a damn thing you can do about it! You can't touch me, Bats. I'm the one in control here. Not you, not the GCPD! Good luck with that. I'm sure it'll work out great. Yeah, it will. You hear me? It will! Go find Joker before he carves up Waller. I'll clean up this mess. Have your people hold back until I call them. Waller's life may depend on a stealthy approach. <laughs> Batman. Good hunting. Got a visual on Joker and Waller. Doesn't look like he's hurt her. Not yet. I'm in the rafters, out of sight. Say the word if you need help. Thanks. Bruce, I know you and Waller have your differences, but she doesn't deserve this. I take complete responsibility. Louder! So the camera can pick it up. Took you long enough. Batman! Thank God! I mean, I assumed you'd be okay. You're Batman, for Pete's sake. But still, are you okay, buddy? I was really worried about you. I'm fine. Of course you are. No way would a couple pesky bombs take you out. <laughs> Things got crazy on that roof, huh? I had to do something. Waller was about to walk away, but get this, I'm this close to getting Waller to admit to every terrible thing she's ever done. And when that's over, I'll deliver her punishment. It'll, of course, have to reflect the enormity of her crimes. The only enormity I'm seeing is your jail sentence. God, I really don't like you. Waller needs to go to trial. Maybe spend the rest of her life in a cell, but not whatever this is. Do you know how long that would take? You know, I, I don't know why you're not more into this. Think of everything she's put you through! 
everyone is disposable to her. Even her own agents. I know I've made mistakes. You try to do the right thing, but there's always a cost. Just ask your pal Batman there. He'll say the same thing. I do what I do for a reason. I'm not ashamed. Don't play innocent. I play to win. When I lose, good people die. You're totally right. She sucks! Let's keep the show rolling. We've heard your excuses. You didn't mean for people to get hurt. Collateral damage, yada yada yada. But there's one crime that can't be excused. You killed the Riddler. And then you tried to pin it on me. I didn't kill him. Like I said. It was you! You killed Riddler! Say it! I will not. If there's one thing I learned by watching you, violence solves a lot of problems! No! Damn it, Batman! Stay out of my way! You need a distraction. Will I get my confession? The way Boss talked about you, I thought you'd be bigger. things your way. I want to just slice her throat right here, right now. But I'm getting proof of her guilt, just for you. This isn't my way. Really? Today, this isn't your way? You're just saying things, trying to trip me up. Just like Waller. She justifies her crimes, says they're for the greater good. Just like you. You both use that word, justice, as an excuse. So you can do whatever you want. I thought you and I were two threads in the same stitch. But it's not me. It's her. I am justice. What I do keeps Gotham from becoming the swamp it once was. I've given everything to protect this city. Delusions of grandeur much? Yet another thing you have in common with Waller. Trying to do things your way was a mistake. Waller killed Riddler. <gasps> and she deserved death! It wasn't Waller! Tiffany? I can't let someone else pay for my crimes. Waller didn't kill Riddler. I did. I know it was wrong. Now. Oh God, are you kidding me? These are the people you want to protect. <laughs> I should kill them both. Everyone here is guilty. <laughs> this, is a, this is a joke. Leave them out of this, Joker. This is about you and me. Tell that to your distraction over there. I used a drone and these. There's your proof. You want to sacrifice yourself for Waller? Then go ahead! Uh, Just hold on. Murder is wrong. Trust the system. Violence isn't the answer. People just pick and choose what they believe. And you're no different. Uh, 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 I've got her! He's down! Hands where we can see them! 
after everything we've been through together. This is how it ends. I'll get you help. I won't abandon you. You want me to go back to the beginning? To Arkham? Where it all started? I've come so far since then, Batman. Because of you. I believed in you, Batman. Like I never believed in anything. And it was all a lie! John. <laughs> That's enough! it. I really wanted to be a hero, you know? <laughs> but I, I, I just can't. I know you used me. 
I, I know. I should hate you for that. <laughs> but I, I don't. Because I, 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 I had such a good time with you, Bruce. Did, did you ever, did you ever think of me as your friend? True friend, so, someone you actually c c care about. Of course, of course, you were my friend. <laughs> you are one messed up guy. <laughs> You too. I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. Batman led the charge. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. I guess that puts me in your debt. It's what I do. I save people. It's a shame we couldn't have saved more. I've got a lot of unpleasant phone calls to make. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Batman and I have some unfinished business. I'll go check on Joker's transfer, make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? We can all play nice now that the bad guy's in cuffs. You don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Then why are we still talking? Tiffany Fox. Riddler's death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really regained a solid footing. I know how you feel. Well, look at that. You and me on the same page for once. I just came here to round up the pact. Quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen. Everything I did, I did for the greater good. To protect Gotham, to uphold the law, to make the world a safer place. You did what you thought was right. I won't judge you. Who knows? Maybe our paths will cross again in the future. Maybe we can work together again. On equal footing, of course. I could see us accomplishing great things, Batman. Now that we understand each other. I'm not in the mood. I'll take that as a no. Get in touch if you ever reconsider. We're out of here. Signal the withdrawal. I'm not gonna miss her, that's for sure. So... Here we are, once again. Gotham safe because of you. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it felt pretty good getting my hands dirty. Just like old times, huh? Truth is, after I got ousted, I didn't know my place anymore. Turned into an old guy in civvies, lurking around crime scenes. Trying to stay useful. We have to work together, Jim. Solve cases. Lock up the scum who terrorize our streets. 
I'd like that. So would I. Oh, uh, I gotta take this. Wife probably saw the news. <laughs> See you around, Batman. Don't be a stranger. Tiffany, we need to talk. Yeah, I figured. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. I've been dreading this moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. Why didn't you talk to me sooner? I... I wanted to work with you, to be part of your mission. But you kept this from me. A murder. I know. I'm sorry. I knew this would ruin everything. You were right. Riddler tore my family apart, Bruce. My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness, but I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless, like my life was crumbling around me. I had to do something to take back control. Please tell me you get that. Revenge is an impulse, one to be checked. I can't condone it, but I do understand it. Thank you. That means a lot. I couldn't bear it if you despised me. So, where do we go from here? I suppose this puts me on your most wanted list. Rather than us working together. If you want to fill your father's shoes, you need to learn right from wrong. You need someone to teach you. You're giving me a second chance? Think of it more as a sentence. You'll have to work hard for your redemption. I promise I won't let you down. Then let's get started. I was going to write a note, but I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Not anymore. 
Then again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? Saying goodbye. I'm leaving, Bruce. It's time I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Like we talked about. Some place in the sun, and on the other side of the world from Gotham. I rather think this vacation will be permanent. But why? This war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. Come on, Alfred. You know I can't do what I do, what we do, without your help. Well, maybe you don't have to do it at all. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore, at least not to me. Now everything has become so gray. <laughs> gray? Talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. Someone clearly challenged with a proven tendency to violence. I'll admit that wasn't our finest moment, but at the time it seemed like our best course of action. Precisely my point. Our best judgment is no longer good enough. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away, inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes, it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. A dreadful thought, I know, but one that keeps me awake at night. I'm not blind to the damage I cause. Nor am I to the chaos that swirls in Gotham. But I have to believe the good outweighs the bad. I thought you did too. Not anymore. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. We put her in danger on her first day. Dodging machine guns at a crime scene. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. You think I want that? We can fix the problem, Al, but not if we run from it. Unless we are the problem. Leaving this all behind might be the only solution. One thing is for certain, my tremors are gone. <laughs> That's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The tremors. The fainting spells. All of it. Alfred, I'm... I'm so sorry. I've caused you so much pain. No, no, please, don't misunderstand me. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you. Not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Alfred, these comparisons... You knew the evil my father was capable of. You think you see that in me? I said nothing about evil, Bruce. Then what are you saying? I'm saying you'll end up in the same place. Face down in an alley. Shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself, along with everything he loved. I enabled him, 
like I've been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. I've failed you, and for that I'm sorry. You did the best you could, Al. In a single night, the family was shattered, and you were left to pick up the pieces. I may have picked them up, but I did a poor job sticking them back together. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. Alfred, wait. Would you stay if I promised things would be different? Is that a promise you can keep? Like you said, there are a lot of ways to help. I'm sure the city could use a man of my talent and resources. Are you sure about this? I'll do whatever it takes to keep our family together, Al. Even this. So please. Tell me you'll stay. Well, maybe just one more night. You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. Thunderbolt! I'm the whole goddamn hurricane! Gotham's safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I weighed my options and what can I say? I don't like to lose. I won't let you down. The criminally insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? If a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? We're two threads in the same stitch, bound together, even under strain.
visitor for John Doe. Bruce!